Hey guys, and welcome back to another part of Let's Play The Sims 3, Supernatural Tendencies. Wow. Alright, we're starting out here as, like, stalkers. I found where this vehicle resides. For some reason, it's outside of the restaurant and business and journalism building. But, we caught it before it could catch us, so we're gonna... In advance, he'll never see us coming. Also, I noticed I have three new gifts to accept, which, you know, let, hmm, let's take a look at them. One from Erica Pat. Hope you like this thingy thing, thingy thingy thing, 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 thing. It is a small ivy. Yay, more plants, because I honestly never ever tend to buy plants. So this is my chance to give back to the green community and we will give you a gift back. Me likey like like this gifty gift gift. Send it back. And another from Blue Birdie saying yay. Ooh. Aw we already have one of these so hmm I'll think of something to do with it. I'll seem to give back. Hopefully it's something awesome. Always hoping. This gift will be the most awesomest ever. Watch, is this gonna be something super? Let's see. And one from Lily. You will receive the exclusive gift from a uh, uh, super semi Zeus uh, super man semi uh, natural. I hope this one is better. This one is a flask of angry bees. A swarm of angry bees in a bottle ready to attack. Ooh, that sounds interesting. Thank you, Lily, Bluebird, and Erica for the gifts. And whoop, let's send you a gift. Thank you, thank, thanks, my friend. <laughs> so... I've been thinking, maybe this little gift thing, since there, it allows a message thing on there, anyone who has Sims 3 Supernatural or whatever, if they have a question they'd normally post in the con uh, in the comment section, they could instead use the little gift there to where I will see it and be able to answer your question in the middle of the episode. So, why is Elena getting all the lifetime reward happiness points for the gifts. It should be shared by the family. That's maybe it's because she's the closest one to the mailbox. I don't get it. But yeah, that could totally be a way for me to answer people's questions while recording at the same time. And I'm all for answering questions, comments, and everything. So I believe in this let's see, we was going to the pool, but on the side I want to have something done. I want her to go to the the gypsy camp and have fortune told. She must get fortune told. I had a funny fortune telling it. Whoa, 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 slow down. Oh, God. Even you're here. It's been, like, it's been a long time, Mr. Deer. Hippity hop, hippy pop pop, hippity hop pop pop. Whoa! I didn't even have to make him disappear. He just like left on his own. So maybe the sound does have magic in it. Could be Sims 3 Supernatural is giving me a little bit of taste of that magic ability. So let's get on with this date. This something tells me this is going to be magical, or I'm just going to push him in the water and then leave if she ever arrives. Is the driver a normal person? She's a normal person. And she's black with auburn hair. That is rare. I think. I think. <laughs> Don't. No, oh wait. Is the person already here? Is that him? I can't tell. I, I don't even remember his name. Yes! He's early, uh, always early and leaves late. Whoa. 
I didn't know this was an indoor. Wait, what is this place? Is this a gym or something? Uh, I'm trying to survey the building. Wow. This is an interesting little. Does it have a basement? No, it doesn't. Who are you? Margobi Maldano. Well, she's a fairy thingy. Okay, let's get in the pool. Swim. Make house spotless and sparkly. I'll do that to our house, but not for the public community pool. Let's see if she's riding on her broom. Look at that. Maybe someday I'll give her a hat. And she. Whoa, 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 what? I. Th How many of you are there? You. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I just don't get it. How many times do I have to do that? This thing is going to, like, stalk all my sims on their way to all of their destinations. That's going to be kind of creepy. Didn't I tell her to get into the pool? Well, then again, it does make sense to meet up with the person she's going out with. Why is he dressed up in a suit at the pool? And I saw a comment where someone was saying that I like the colors yellow and black, but I have a habit of taking a sim family and assigning a color scheme to them so I could easily recognize them in case I started playing different sims within the same city. Sims in the city. Let's see if Nick has... Oh, who is he talking to? Don't talk... That's just creepy. Go... Go research. That is they're talking to the mail girl, paper girl. She's underage. Stop it. All right, that's gonna take her a little while. Okay, yeah, that's cool and all, but get in the pool. Like seriously, you're not gonna drown. Elena Lovelace and the fortune teller drain the last of the tea and try and find patterns in the leaves at the bottom of their cups. Some symbols have universal meaning, but others require an expert's interpretation. Should the fortune teller continue to gather information or perform a prediction now? Let's donate a little bit extra. You always want to take extra cash. I hate when they do that. Hey. Who is this person? He's like got this happy little stride going. Is he jogging or is he like, who is this? Uh, and the, he weakened the sound of the pop. I couldn't do it that time. Therefore, he lives today. You live, sir. You're a lucky winner. Also, I would like to tell people that you should really, really check out my other series that I have going on, like the. Portal 2 series that I was uploading stuff for. I still have some episodes left to upload of it, but I've just been slowing down on them. You should, if you haven't already, you should check out that series. It's pretty hilarious. Oh, wait. Elena Lovelace tries to relax as the fortune teller holds her hand firmly in place. Oh, we know what this is. Palm up with one finger, the fortune teller begins to trace the lines in her skin, gathering information about her temperament, longevity, and romantic inclinations. Should the fortune teller continue to gather information or form a prediction now? We'll let you keep going for more money. But that's the last bit of money you get. And the fairy's in the water. Let's see. You two should play in the water. But yeah, I also have a Terraria. Who have a, a splash them and then have a breath holding contest. I have a Terraria playthrough going on. It's starting out slow, but as things and items in the game picks up, of course it will be awesome. And I also have a playthrough of Magicka that I need to upload another episode for, and probably will soon. So, come on. That was like a quick splash. The fortune teller stares intently into the crystal ball. 
inside it. A miniature maelstrom of spiritual energies swirl. As the fortune teller studies the ebb and flow of energy within the crystal, more and more detail about the future reveals itself. Should the fortune teller continue to gather information or form a prediction now? You shall form it now. That better make you form it. Wow, fairies can't hold their breath for very long. Look at her, she's like a champ down there. Like, what is that noise? It's like something's going on around town. Is it upstairs or? I can't tell. Maybe it's in the bathroom. Oh, maybe it's just my imagination. Or maybe somebody needs some more of the deletion. Who knows? Wait, where's he? Where's he going? What? Wait. Wait. What's this all about? The group outing, the little, little, group outing was fantastic. No epic is the word. Wait, that's not the way to describe it either. Legendary is the only way to describe it. I won't do anything I wouldn't do except I already know that you won't. Calls the fortune teller as Elena Loveless leaves the caravan. What? Wait, maybe that noise was him discovering the recipe for ad nauseum. Hmm. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to end the episode here. And the next episode, we will be trying out this flask of angry bees. I guess I should use these other potions as well. At least as they become available. But uh, most importantly, I want to see what the flask of angry bees does. Is there anybody nearby for her to test it out on? No, what's that? I don't even know how to pronounce that word, but she's going to harvest it. So, guys, if you liked the video, I hope you liked the video, click the like button. Share it with your friends, favorite, and if you haven't done so already, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. I will see you guys in the next video.